Welcome to one of the cornerstone cities for the MFL, Grim Bay, Wisconsin, home of the attackers. Also home of the first semi-successful head transplant, Grim. Yeah, whatever happened to that poor guy? Well, he did all right for himself. He's the state mascot for head cheese. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Nuke London Hatriots take on the Grim Bay Attackers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If the sound of a torrent Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. That's a six yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Man, this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. To the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, and it's first and ten. Cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Second down and more than the QB would like. They need to make him a target more often. First down and six. He just... You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. never happened because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Pow! With the brain scrambler. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he punched his way out of that tackle. Oh man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. This guy's a brick. 
Bricks should Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Seven. Oh man, what a throw! That sonic blast just cleared. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch! First and two. <laughs> and that'll be second down and four. And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll bring up third and one. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> they need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And like Bricks' is bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And he zings it in there for a nine yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. Third and four. The defender says, I don't think so. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey, a sawbuck says he misses. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> Boom! And it's first and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? 
Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had shown on today. Looks like it's a good fit. to the races. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. Second down and ten. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Second down and ten. First down and one. Second and three. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third down and five. And I've had it. I'm gonna, oh, with the punishing hit. season dumbass actually i think he's talking about the time warp dirty trick that the defense just played still a dumbass though he had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it it's not short but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again hmm and he is automatic nice kick boring just give him the points and let's move on When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? And it's first and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know how to throw winners. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And 
And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth thrown out of the roof of my mouth? What? Oh, I love this journey. Fumble! you got to protect the ball better than that. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He could go all the... Yeah, never mind. And it's first and ten. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined, you'd expect him not to play like total shit. No argument. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. This is really a violent game, guys. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this Ackman. He could go all the way. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. And it's first and ten. This is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The offense is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. And it's first and ten. Covered your ears, Bridge, because that was a sun. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. I'm going to wreck it. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, no good. Now that punter's gonna find it. And he just lets that one go. He says, no thank you, and the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his... And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. <laughs> and 
Giants first and ten. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Second down and ten. A Republican congressman hits the airport man. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. First down and one. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! They're going for two. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And he breaks away. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Well, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort. And he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but you know, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. Thank you that mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. That's a six-yard gain on that catch. Third and four. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. Third down and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Yeah, we 
The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. He refuses to go down. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but... It's didn't see it. At least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Okay, he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because this could to know whose eyes the QB is using. 
but can we get him some new ones? His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait a minute. What the? Ah, uh, did they? Didn't they just? Uh, am I losing my mind? Or did that play that I saw just not happen? Uh, I gotta stop smoking them on tidy laundry pods. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckle. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, and Douglas Power and Grim was a high cool! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy, and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. And he breaks away. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo grip. And that'll be second down and four. Third down and, well, good luck. Another loser bites the dust. And the MFL winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. 
And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of Brown Newton, man. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. The defense erases the previous play by transporting the offense back in time. I heard that Time Warp 30 Trick uses advanced alien black hole technology. Yeah, your entire life is one big black hole. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. Second down and long. Wow, the quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his... Man, what a hit that was. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. Does the QB know? Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. And the QB decides to throw the ball away. Second down and ten. Hard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Third and two. And the defense gets another pick. Oh, with the brutal hit. First and ten. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Second down and six. At this rate, the QB is going to have. Oh, he just got popped big time. Oh my God! I thought his head was going to pop off like a big zip. And it's first and ten.
First and four. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. He was stuck at the line of scrimmage. Third and four. Three yard catch on the play. Every little bit counts. Those three yarders might grow up the. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And they'll line up for the field goal. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks, it means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an extra. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. <laughs> and then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than a cute. And that player just transformed into a giant. Good luck. And, and he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Graham. Oh, Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. First and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. And this guy is on Fuego. Does he like his original or extra crispy? <laughs> By the looks of it, extra crispy. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. Kabam! Man, the defender just lays a vicious hit on the receiver and jars the ball loose. Second down and ten. is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Boom! Get him down! He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge! That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful.
vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Ah, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but yeah, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? That's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Ben? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it. And it's first and ten. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Pussy's bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Glenn. And that's a good by the numbers throw. And those numbers add up to two. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Oh, what a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and ten. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move him back nice. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. 
Bricks. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. Well, two years ago, this guy was a buried, rotting corpse at the edge of the galaxy. And today, look at him. He's a dancing, scoring machine. Yeah. What a story. What a, what a wonderful story. Alex. They want more points, so they're going for two. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. It got blown to shit. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's math exactly yeah. and the quarterback goes into a hurry up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Since when is that a penalty? Huh? Since now, I guess, Grim. <laughs> Time to sp it's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Passes for a touchdown. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about... The defense comes up big, stopping a two-point attempt. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. And that, ladies and gentlemen, 
Rose and Newton says how you recover an onside kick. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. He is fighting for it like Brooks' bowels. He is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it looks like we've got a penalty here. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the... Put that one in the loss column. The Grim Bay attackers lose the game. And they lost me 50 bucks. They battled hard but still got their butts handed to them. Gross. I hope there weren't any old butts involved. I kind of like our butts, especially with some Deshaun mustard and a smoked pickle relish. Not that's living. Let's go down to the field and see what the game's MVP thinks of today's outcome. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.